Well, guys, it's been uh, a number of years since I have touched the YouTubes. Uh, let's see if this uh, old U4 boomer still gots it. We're going to be playing as the Tim Raids and just seeing how a little uh, World Conquest will, uh, will, will, will fare. I, I don't know if I can. We'll find out. All right, let's see what's going on here. Uh, selling titles. I don't even remember the meta, man. Oh, I'm going to embarrass myself here so much. Okay, uh, missions, liberty to desire. Subjects, this one we need to do. We need taxation. Yes, I remember that part. Yeah, just get all this stuff for Shah Rukh. Why not? Kirk provinces to Sunni, we're gonna wait on that. Sure, we'll do that. Good enough for now. We're still making some money. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. I need to hire armies. Uh, well, well, that's a mistake. Um, we need to get to land force limits. So, oh, dude, I don't remember. Do, do you seize land? What's the meta here? I don't remember, dude. Shoot. Oh, just diplomats, right? That's good. We have a lot of. Uh, that's not really good right now. We have quite a few Shia provinces. We're going to be taking on a lot more once we can, once we, uh, inf once we get our subjects integrated. That's the word. Um, well, that's definitely a merchants thing. Where's the, where's the money? Can you just sell titles now? Do they remove that from the game? Oh my god! I can't believe it took me this long to find it here. Indebted to the burgers. I just needed some money. All right, that's good. Now we just need to build. Build them like right there. That'd be great. We'll marry all of our. All of our guys, and we can take the Mamluks there. We're gonna be doing uh, some religious converting. We're not gonna be using the Dimini State too much. Armies. We'll hit the increased levies after we're done. We'll give them right of capital. Ooh, we need this too. Strong duchies. Yes, please. Young duchies, that does a mission. These are at least 40%. There we go, military and prestige. Now I just need to get some wars going. All right, we got build the force limit. Am I forgetting to do anything? Don't have Shah Rukh die, right? That's the big thing. Gathering storm, yeah, we don't want him to die. Um, I need another one of these guys. My Shabahid has fallen. Um, let's rival Ajam right away. Right, we need to declare war for reconquest. Let's boogie. And we'll make our air general three siege. Alright, Shawrug died. We're starting again. Unfortunately, probably not going to get that siege general, but uh, we're going to try and take advantage of some of these uh, things we learned in the first five minutes of the of the last game so liberty desire absolutely this one I need to remember to take right before I annex my subjects like when they're at a hundred percent like that day tick do that because otherwise I'm gonna get the annexation penalty and Sistan will take forever to integrate so I have to remember to take that if I don't that's I'm, I'm shit out of luck um, monthly mill power those are the only things you need from that Lemma. I'll take the monthly admin. I'll give you some oversight. We'll just diplomats. Merchants. You can have free enterprise, that's fine. Just get the loyalty increasing. Where is the indebted? There's too many of these now. There we go. Let's take some loans. I'll take the prestige. Give the Domini. Tolerance is good. I like that. Use land. Some in the diets. Base production, base tax. Let's take the base production. Gotta spend dip on that. I don't know if I want to. The Mamluks. Right away. Advisors. Discipline advisor. Good. Production advisor. Good. I'll take tax, though. 
Send these guys up here. And uh, we'll unpause. Alright, Royal Mary, everyone. Okay. Gathering Storm, Shara could die. Don't like that. Build the Force Limit. Boom. Emory Little Ship. Boom. Alright. We can now rival. Dom. Oh, he's pretty good, but he doesn't have a siege pip like the other guy did. You need a leader. Please give a siege pip. Nothing. Okay, that's unfortunate. But we will make do. Oh, unfortunately, we let a couple of days pass. We weren't paying attention. Uh, maybe they got a couple more allies. Maybe they didn't. But we have to declare this war now. Or else we're not going to be able to win. So um, we should probably piece no guy out. I'm going to set everybody to siege and set some more targets in no guy. And get their capital out. That'd be amazing. Let's send Transox up there. Keep all of our subjects on siege. And the last saves war was a lot easier than this one. All right. All right. Let's stack wipe a couple of little one stacks. Good. Oh, big wins! Big wins! Nice, 10k stack wipe, sweet. Alright, now we're going to chase down this stack from Mazarandan. I will, I do want to release Kazak at some point, um, because they have a crap ton of cores, and that's going to be a very powerful vassal to help me finish off India. So we're going to try and do that at some point. Okay, nice 9k stack wipe in the mountains. Alright, we're going to fight them on the... Mountain Fort, that's going to be probably another stack wipe. Get the morale tick. Bada bing bada boom, another stack wipe. We're just killing them now. Let's look at the... Yeah. We're smoking them. 60 Tradition General, not bad. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Ooh, good. Put him on that. Combat General. That shot coming in clutch. Wowzers. Yeah, we've stack wiped tens of thousands of troops now. That's crazy. Not, barely any of that is from attrition. As Randon rents another unit? Dude. Alright, we're going to take this before we lose some men to some sloppy positioning. Almost all their money and war reps in a separate piece. Belkadir will peace out because they're pretty much all the way occupied, so we're just going to get rid of them. First, we will Royal Mary the Auto Blob. All right, we help them finish the Siege on Shiver. We can white piece them out of the war, and we can finish off these guys that will accept our peace offer. I think that's what we want. Um, that's not going to give us any dip. Aggressive expansion is minimal. Um, we're able to take these guys in the next war. We don't need this province, so we're just going to wait our 11 days and send our demand. Then we're going to send our men off to Transoxiana for that. How far are we from influence annexing vassals? January 54, so we still got a number of years. Um, so I am going to give tr take some land for, for Transox. I am going to um, release the um, Ozic Vassal. We get to peace out. And we have a center of trade to upgrade. Sweet. Alright, so that gets expand the Timurids. We get um, dev cost and stuff in Herat. Um, if I remember correctly, I'd like to dev the Renaissance in Herat. So, um... That's going to be helpful for 25 years, so yeah, we'll be able to do that. Or you can statify this for free as well. They are, of course. 40,000 army, then we get some claims to India. We can start at conquering fast versus slow. So let's see, do we really want to get 40,000? No, we're just going to chill for a little bit. But take it slow. I mean, this is a good first game coming back. I'm not freaking expert anymore. Not for, not for a long time. Alright, wait for the diplomat to come back. 
And we are going to take this province. And it's just going to be really simple. We're going to sit on it. I don't know if we're going to core it or not. We might core it. We still have six years left. Finally get some military access through the Great Horde. That's going to be nice to uh, be done a little bit. I mean, I probably have enough, really, to get what I want. After just occupying a fort, maybe. Take Miltech. Be focusing on admins and something to be getting a lot of provinces. Um, we are... F we can afford money. I'm going to take... Spy Network for now. Alright, money from Uzbek and war reps plus the one province. Alright. 24% overextension. I don't need to core that. I'm just going to release it right away. This one... How do I release a vassal again? Diplomacy. There we go. That's the one. I can release Kazakh if I need to. Uh, I will wait on that until after I integrate uh, my subjects. Now that I'm at peace, I'm going to shoot over an alliance offer to Yas. And I can get a religious scholar of aggressive expansion minus 10%. Cost of 49 admin. These guys, let's see, the Indian route. Prepare for war, we don't need to get this. We can just fight on Merc Pop Manpower for now. Um, 40,000. 40,000 troops, we only need 11. No, we need, yeah, we only need 11,000. 11, so we can just get the Grand Company. Um, park them over here. And but we can start going to war. We might just dismiss them after a little bit, but I, I'd like to spend some Merc Manpower on these wars. Um, if I'm gonna be doing this, I, I gotta, I gotta do it right. Let's, let's go, let's go into the, into India right away. Sure, I'm freaking with Afghanistan, because I needed to take row from them. Indian raid. We got a general. We take Punjab. Uh, I know to form the Mughals, I just need one of each. So probably Lahore or, yeah, probably Lahore or Doeb. The center of trade. And Delhi. Alright, my subjects are being a little obnoxious. We're not going to set them to siege. We can repay the loans. Excellent. In which case, we can always take more loans, which would give us a lot of money. Let's see, 75 dip for some inflation. It's early game, we'll get that. I can probably take tech soon, because I am behind on dip. That's probably worth it. I wonder if it's better to take um, the provinces I need from Mughals right away. At Punjab, if I get oh, I need all of them. Get this one. Oh, I don't like that. I'd be better off just get... You know, let me just build a spy network on these guys. I'd be better off just getting... Forming the Mughals before even doing that mission. What does this mission even give me? 25 years of discipline. That's nothing. I don't need that. And that's just a lot of AE. I'd rather get the Mughals up and running before that. I think I wait and get the CCR first from the Mughals. I don't, I don't, I, I don't think pouring all this is, is, is the right call. But we're gonna wait. We're just gonna take what we need. More, that's less. And that's that. Another army, I'm missing one, aren't I? You're way up here. Why have you been up there so long, dude? Get down here. Start the war off with the victory of some sorts. That's our peace deal. Gonna make a few people mad, but we will survive. And um, that's it. That's all we need to do. So we got a wall breach on Lahore. Advisor cost or loyalty? I will take the advisor cost for how many years is that? That's a lot. A lot of years. Um, I can take dip tech now. Okay, we get a sack of Lahore, lose some ducats, gain some professionalism. I will take it. 
Maybe I'll send these guys down here to help my... God damn, really? Okay, um... We have a fucking... God air, let's go! Okay. Oh, I thought that was gonna be really bad for a minute. Okay, so we have... I mean, we can abdicate after this guy gets of age, but... Missionary strength, I don't know how much we'll use that. I mean, he's just a very average, average ruler, and that's just something you know you have to deal with. Um... So, we're just gonna have to deal with that. And, um... We are ahead on... We're, I mean, we're on time with, uh, admin, so... We're gonna have to boost our stab, um... Before we get our overextension, so I'm just gonna boost that now. Religious unity is unfortunate, but something we have to deal with. Boost that up to zero just for now. Um, we gotta save the rest of our admin for coring these provinces, though. You know what? Tolerance is pretty good, too. I don't want rebels. That's gonna be one of my biggest downfalls. We'll take that royal marriage again. Um, probably royal marry. Ottomans again. All right, Sin will peace out. More ups, I don't want your money. I need to send these guys back north to do with the tribes. All right, Renaissance is here, so I can start deving that. Um, do do do. I want to do that in Herat because I do have that bonus. I do have that bonus dev cost reduction from the mission. Um, yeah, I'll do that, and then I'll I'll I'll, I'll dev the next institution in Delhi. Got to make sure my merchants are happy. That's good. They are. Yeah, and my dumbass forgot that expand administration was a thing, so I forgot to do that, and I wasted a bunch of mana here. So, um, yeah, that, that's the learning learning lesson for next time. All right, got that down. All right, let's try and get some more money out of them. Want all of it. Four reps, please. Should let me piece them out, these guys out for whatever I want. I'm going to take that plus a bunch of cash. Give me a few days. Then next year, we'll be able to integrate our subjects. And we're sitting very pretty. Then we can start conquesting on Uzbek, who um, the truce will expire in 57. Peace these guys out. A little bit of a dip there, but okay. Um, Overextension's a little high. So. I'm gonna take, make my capital very expensive to dev. Also, it's going to make everything a lot cheaper for me. Four. We're going to do it. All right, so here's the fun part now. Uh, we get to recall him. And let's make sure we take this. This province shall take from Afghanistan. We have that so they're loyal. And we get pretty much everything. Uh, let's take, let's core Delhi. we need to core as well, so that's another 76 admin we need. The end of the month. There we go. Peace. Lots of prestige. Um, we get a mission, control lower Persia. Buckets of ducats. Alright, now in four days we can um, take care of him. This truce is uh, going to be a longer one. Relationship with him is not that great. Uh, we'll also improve with Yas. We can get that free vassal. And let's take a look at our armies. We're 10k over. I'm going to go and get rid of free company. 
rid of those cav. I don't need those cav. I need to core two more provinces and I can form the Mughals and then we're going to core the rest. Come on, alright. Who else can I possibly get a free vassal on? But what we're going to do right away so we don't forget going to release Ozik as a vassal. These mamajamas have a lot of cores. So we're going to feed the heck out of them and um, use our downtime to create a large vassal. In just three years, we're going to start doing that. That is awesome. And uh, yeah, we'll just uh, play on speed four or five until uh, things settle down a little bit and we can start conquesting India, get some more admin power, form the Mughals. Ready? Our vassal down. There. And uh, we can get a couple more. We're going to get Biapas as a free vassal too. Let's see if we get our diplomat back. Great. Try and get as many Diplo relations as we can. We could go to war with Nogai right now just to get um, two cores back for Kazakh. That might not be a bad idea. Um, and after the truce ends here, fight Uzbek. Thank goodness we need the admin. Spare no expense, please. Government reform. Okay, this is a big one. What to take? What to take? Axe is good. Manpower is good. Stab cost is great. I'm going to be stacking a lot of stab cost this game, so I wonder if that wouldn't be the worst thing. I think money's going to be more important. We're going to go for the tax right now. Okay, this is probably dumb. I'm going to boost this twice. I will get 100 admin back. I wish I got a stab event, but I, I, I have not gotten one. The overextension is is killing me, but um, I will get 100 admin back. And the 15 years of shock damage may or may not be worth it. Uzbek Truce is done. Alright, time to go. And now we have to save up admin. I gotta get this, and I gotta get three admin ideas, so... Can't spend Abin on conquering until after we get that done, so let's just do that. Another vassal. His and Kaipa and Yas both won wars on their own, so that's kind of nice to get a little bit more land for free. Oh, heck yeah. Abin tech cost. Means I can get my first idea group. Out of time again, and we can start working on Abin ideas. I want this before I start conquering land. So we're gonna have to go about 1200 admin. Nice. 110 ducats. Let's just send that, get them out of the war. It means I can send this peace deal. And uh, 11 aggressive expansion for quite. A lot of dev. Does it say how much development? Oh, but we can check. Kazakh has three development at the moment. Unless they dev themselves up a little bit. Three. Check it after the peace deal. Wow. Three, two. 95. You got 92 dev out of that situation. Still have a few cores left in Chagatai and three in Uenogai. So we'll do those wars soon as well. The great power rankings, we are 671. So we're almost number one great power. So we're a uh, tech ahead of the Ming. All right, so in order to from the Mughals, this needs to be a state. And that be enables this mission. So we're going to get some base tax some tolerance, get some governing capacity, and get the uh, additional um, stuff. But before we're going to do this, we're going to annex Sistan, and we're going to get the 20% core creation cost for 15 years. We're going to use that to snowball into India. So we're going to wait 
um, until that is done before we take the decision to form the Moogles. Nice, get a little bit of manpower. Idea. I'm an advisor cost. Take it. Need to get to our third idea group. Alright, now let's take some money out. We need to get to 61 troops. Alright, so I'll just pick the best general amongst these these cab stacks. Yes. Um, it's gonna be this one. I can just disband it right away. It's kind of a waste of money, but it's not at all. I got Sistan, so now we can take a couple days to do all the missions. Sweet. Okay. Here for war, morale of armies. Bunch of claims. Bunch of claims. 20 years of core cost reduction. Okay. The rest of these we don't really need. Um, that's not going to happen anytime soon. That's not going to happen anytime soon. That's not going to happen until after the war, but it's only 100 admin for taking these two. I mean, is it 100 admins, 100 admin, bro? We go for it. All right, we wait just a little bit longer. Oh, we have great relations. Why do you think a stab hit for this? Good relations? We get the worst relations. Who's your enemies? You're rival to... I ally you. Yeah. There we go. Man, that was annoying. Alright, boys. 100 admins, 100 admin. Get a free vassal out of the situation. So, happy with that. Means I get my final mission here. And I have no qualms about hitting the Form the Mughal Empire button. That we'll go ahead and do that. Traditions and ambitions. Yes, please. We have to move our trade capital back to Persia. So that's cost a little bit of dip. That's fine. I don't remember if it's if it's better to trade company India or not, but I do know that now that we have our 25% core creation cost in here, it'll be a lot cheaper to do all of this stuff. So, um, I'm gonna core all this up. I'm gonna wait on this tech, and then we start expanding rapidly. In the meantime, uh, we'll just kind of get our economy situated. Let a month tick just so we can get our, um, figure out what we are doing for money. Doing good, doing good, doing good. Okay, our army maintenance is a little high. Get rid of them. They were expensive, but you need the monies instead. So we'll get 12 ducats a month. At the moment, we could take these guys out. That would cancel our lines with Mishasha. That'd be good. Why do the, does everybody love us? Can I just send an insult to you, please? Randan, I need your trade. You're killing me at the moment. So let's fix our trade. So we'll use our vassal's claims. And we're just going to feed them the three provinces. Um, because why not? I need to save my admin for a little bit. There. Ah, lots of claims. Okay. We're going to have to start conquering. Which is the first age ability. We'll take the AE impact. That's going to really help us out in India. All right, now that we have our loyal subjects, uh, we can take the core creation cost to even stack that further. If we look at our total CCR, all right, total core creation cost. Admin efficiency we don't have yet. But core creation cost reduction, we have minus 49.2%. That's literally half off cores. That's crazy. Be super piece these guys. I want their money. Or ups and trade power too. That'd be great. All of your stuff to go to my vassal. Cost me no admin. Need little aggressive expansion. That's about it. 
three years from now or so, we get 25% more CCR, and then it's time to go to town in India. Alright, just peace out of this war. I don't need anything more than this. Alright, I need to get onto Karkinlu to get some more Persia trade node. Or Ottomans gobbles that up. All the money you'll give me. Give me war ups too. Pretty much. Alright, sweet. On the border. Start the war now. About damn time. Alright, our leader died. Our ruler has just turned 15. This is perfect. Oh my goodness, we're going to be gaining so many points. Alright, here we go. Finally, we get the core creation cost reduction. We're going to sit on this for a little while. Um, start using our admin more productively. If we go look at the uh, modifiers, which are located... Here, our core creation cost is quite literally 74%. We need to use this now before that 20 years runs out. We still got some good time on that. But on the permanent claims on India, that's where it's going to be really, really, really cheap. We should probably start doing some double header wars over in here. Our truce is almost up with Delhi. That's going to be sweet. Punjab. A lot of cores, but I'd rather just take them out all at once. Lujistan would not join, Sindh would join, I would white piece Sindh out of this. Alright, let's just get going. Alright, this is the peace offer we're doing. Taking quite a bit of land for ourselves. But let me just show you. We're going to concentrate the development a little bit here. And, uh... Look at those core costs. It's literally one to one. That is insane. Done. That's insane. Delhi is up. Empor is guaranteeing. Sind is. So basically, we peace jump. We're out. Once troops get closer, we're going to just declare war on Delhi right away. All right, let's do debase for some free money. The corruption. Fight. I uh, want the next deck. Get our cav while we still have some. I can just take this province for myself. Get the core on that for six admin. I could take central Doab or maybe this one, and then I can get yeah central Doab. That way I can touch both of these guys. Take that. Oh, we're at war with John Poor. We're going to take that as well. I'll take all of this from these guys. We're going to core that up. Back wipe them. They're going to want to surrender now, right? Yeah, okay, I guess I'll just have the occupations of the forts. We can take care of business. Make sure we get this aggressive expansion scholar. I don't know why I wasn't sitting on that earlier. A little bit of money would help. All I need. Alright. This is the PC we're going to take from Delhi. Get all these claims plus one province, plus these two provinces. They're going to be non co belligerent, but um, I'm not worried about that coalition. A little high on the overextension, but just look at that. That's crazy. It costs literally nothing. And soon we're going to be able to get the... That's my Punjab mission. Gotta get the autonomy low, and then we can get um, a bunch more claims. And uh, once we get this stuff, we get more claims all over here. So, um, two wars. One with Malwa, one with Maywar. And let's stay up, the deck, uh, stay up to date on tech. Seven years ahead of time, we'll get our next idea group, which is going to be religious, because we're going to be needing that Deus Vault at some time in the near future. So... That might be good. Actually, you know what? We're going to go Diplo second. We want the Provincial War score cost first. Let's do that. Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, well, this is a, a little bit of a time lapse to show you guys how we have been doing sped up. Um, in the next video, we're going to be conquering some more of India and getting towards our uh, really, really powerful 
Moogle's admin efficiency, and other bonuses, as well as snowballing our economy. So this is kind of where we left off at about 1472. You can see that we're snowballing pretty strong, and now that we're the Moogles, we can start conquering India pretty quickly in the next video. So if you want to see that, make sure to subscribe. We're going to be posting videos every single week um, in the, for the immediate future going forward. we got a lot of videos stockpiled, so I'm not going to just disappear on you guys again. So uh, with that being said, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again next time.